York County officials found jail administrator Michael Vitiello's policy of no mask wearing inside the jail last year did not adhere to CDC guidelines. In August, a coronavirus outbreak infected more than 90 prisoners and staff. I feel that he's being blamed and he's being thrown under the bus. Vitiello attorney Michael Waxman says early in the pandemic, Vitiello had opposed masks because he thought they'd panic prisoners. Then as science changed and he learned this, he began to stockpile PPE and get ready for the universal masking as well as for staff's health screening. Waxman showed me an email from last June of Vitiello pressing the York County manager to collectively bargain with the Corrections Officers Union for a new policy for masks and temperature checks. He was asking, are we going to get this done or not? Are we going to require or allow masking in the jails? And that never, there was never a response and that never happened. Days before the outbreak, Sheriff William King emailed Vitiello to say, you should be teaching a State Department of Corrections class on sustaining operations during COVID-19. A few months earlier, a handwritten note from King said, I don't tell you enough how much I appreciate you. The county manager, sheriff and CO union representative didn't have any further comments today. Vitiello's attorney says they'll likely contest the firing. In Westbrook, Phil Hirschkorn, WMTW News 8.